Welcome back guys, it's CryptoRocko here with another technical analysis video. Today guys, rather than starting with Bitcoin, I wanted to start with XRP guys because Ripple and XRP has one of, been one of the most promising coins and it, it was the coin that started this bounce. Usually Bitcoin starts the crypto bounces, this time it was Ripple XRP that was leading the bounce. So I thought I'd start the analysis with this video. So what we're looking at is we had that big bull volume guys, bull bull move and there was consolidation and it probably pulled back a bit more than my liking i was hoping it would wouldn't pull back more than the 50 percent level but it was good to see that push again we had like another 20 percent price price increase which was great to see now we're seeing some consolidation and equilibrium pattern uh, we can see there's an inside bar forming and i think today and potentially tomorrow we might be in this inside bar but we'll have to see how this plays out guys um so this is what we're seeing on the breakout if we break up below the 50 percent level um i'm afraid we might drop down to the 618 level or potentially to these uh, previous uh support levels and um, but it's not looking great so I, I hopefully it will stay above this 50 percent level because there's obviously this inside bar break and also uh, the fibonacci level from the from the big swing so this is what we're looking at hopefully it will stay above it and if it can break above this kind of descending trend line then it could potentially have another higher up there's no reason why it can't just uh, go up it's ripple we're talking about although you could we think about it could go down it is ripple and it is unpredictable and some of the things that's been going on fundamentally with ripple there's no reason why we can't just go higher and higher from here because we have we have formed like a higher low uh, lower high, higher low, lower high. So we could um, the, the high, sorry, higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low. So there's no reason why we can't move up. Although we're kind of forming a tightening pattern now, where we're forming higher, 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 lower highs. So it could get confusing around here. What what happens? But there's no reason why this equilibrium, the inside bar that I was looking at, and again on on the four hour as well, we've got four inside bar guys. So the breakout. Um, we, when it, this this inside bar kind of broke broke down but we're still in this level we're still inside this uh this big green volume so we'll have to see how this plays out this is what ripple is i mean i'm not trading we're in between the uh moving average the 20 and 50 moving average it's in like a no man's land so i'm not really looking to trade xrp um i, I shared my trade i got into this trade uh, i played like a oversold bounce you could see this i've got a proof uh, on my twitter the 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 way this trade played it was a great trade guys and nine percent is nothing to sniff at it's a really really good profit especially um if you're trying to trade day trade so that was really good trade for me uh quite happy with that but yeah currently guys i'm just waiting to see if it goes below this 50 percent level i might look to sell because we could see uh drop down to 618 level and that level uh but it, there's no reason why it can't break up so i'm waiting on the sidelines to see what xrp does bitcoin is the same guys it's difficult to see what's going to happen we are seeing some uh red it looks like it's going down and it could jump off this i don't know if this trend line is very constructive because it's only we have two touches uh but it, the, the the trend line the below trend line is probably a bit stronger so you could try and get out if it breaks down these trend lines but i think it will have it will see another upside um it could see it could see another upside now and hit that level or hit the above level the rsi is quite low um i i if i had to put my money on i see it uh maybe down here and then an upside or maybe jump off this two three six level we, we've we struggled to go above the 50 uh, not 0.5 Fibonacci level so we'll have to see what happens again Bitcoin is sideways movements sometimes I feel like I'm repeti uh, repeating myself on this trend technical analysis video guys but you've got to be really careful you can't just jump into any trade and risk really losing your money we have to jump in the high probability high risk to reward trading strategies guys so be careful guys I'm not looking to trade Bitcoin at the moment um, I'm looking more closely to I've, tra I've tweeted about um, Polymath it's a project that I like um, and it's looking good as well so that's a potential trade uh, that I could do today but on the big ones guys there's I'll show you the one that I am looking to trade which is Litecoin I'll do that at the end um, Ethereum something's going to happen in Ethereum in the next couple of days guys uh, it's a very very tightening pattern guys it's a very str uh, strong equilibrium pattern and as you can see it's coming to the end of it there's going to be a break above or break below we're not sure where it's going to break but I'm going to play that level and um, 
so that is what's going on with uh, Ethereum. Again, you could move to the shorter time frames and and try and play some bounces and some some really quick scalps. But again, I'm not really looking to do that. There's other bigger fish to fry. So you could maybe draw a trend line and look that the um, Ethereum to break that, or you could have. Um, uh, were there any trade opportunities in Ethereum? Maybe sold it around there. I don't know what the RSI was like. Maybe an RSI oversold bounce. So there are potential trades that you could do. Again, I'm not really looking to trade. You could have maybe sold there because um, from the higher low, I uh, we'll need to look at some other 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 signals. Again, there are potential trades that you can get into, but I'm not really looking to trade at the moment because, like I said, I'm looking at other things and it's not really strong. I'm waiting patiently. You have to make sure you save your money. I'm waiting patiently for this breakout because I believe this breakout will be quite big and I'm sure there's inside bars as well forming on the on the daily on the weekly as well let's have a look yeah there's an inside bar forming as well so we'll have to see how that breaks out um, so yeah this is what I'm looking I mean the, the break of this inside bar could signal where which way it goes it could go above to around there the the move 50 moving average or it could potentially break down I'm, I'm, I don't want to see it I don't, I don't want to say where it will go down if it breaks down but if it does break down guys it won't be pretty yeah it could potentially drop to the 618 level probably around there we'll have to see guys let's not uh, be skeptic now let's hope that the inside bar break is upwards but we'll have to see how what bitcoin does as well because bitcoin is still king although xrp is doing well bitcoin is still king so yeah, it's bouncing off this um, the the 20 moving average now it could drop below if it breaks down this level right and um, let's have a look at Litecoin so Litecoin was the, one of the only ones that I was quite positive on and I was hoping that it could break above so the, we had a bullish crossover of the moving averages and we, we saw good volume strong green candle so I was hoping Litecoin would be a positive one and I didn't I missed that trade but I was hoping that I could get into like a pullback and we could break above it but unfortunately we've seen some red candles now and it looks like it might just bounce off the 20 moving average and this trend line so yeah Litecoin was a potential one and um, this good green volume I was hoping for a higher low and potentially break uh, the level we had three four touches of the trend line so it was looking really good for Litecoin unfortunately Litecoin also failed to materialize so this is a trade I was talking about guys I am um, it happened during midnight um, in a, in a UK so I couldn't play that trade but that that was a trade that you could have possibly played so yeah those are the big four guys that I wanted to look at um, uh, if there are any other coins that you want me to look at, I used to do uh, Tron and Verge and a couple other coins but I've not had much demand for it so I'm not really doing the technical analysis on them. I might do one on Polymath because uh, that is one that I'm looking at uh, and Litecoin is another one that I'm potentially looking at for a bounce because it, it, it has seen some volume increase so uh, I, I was kind of more hopeful and optimistic on Litecoin but after this red volume I'm not as much uh, but again we'll have to see if it can uh, it's still on the daily it's still uh, the it's still bullish because the, the the 20 moving average is above the 50 moving average so you could see a bounce of this so you could you, you could see a bounce of this and of that and you could potentially uh, hit the upward level so yeah that's what we're looking at guys i hope you've enjoyed this video if you want me to do any specific technical analysis for a coin let me know in the comment section below and um yeah i've been doing a lot of videos on ripple xrp and, and xrp has had some really positive news and a lot has been going on with swell uh, event with bill clinton and brad garlinghouse so that was an interesting video i might do an update on that later on so thank you very much for watching this video guys i hope you've enjoyed it if you have enjoyed it smash that like button subscribe to my channel and also guys leave your xrp address below if you want to win 200 dollars worth of xrp i've tweeted this on my twitter i used to do 100 dollars but uh, on my next target guys i'll be doing a three um, 250 thousand 250 dollar uh, worth of xrp giveaway so make sure you smash that like button subscribe to my channel turn on the notification button and leave your xrp address below so thank you very much for watching this video guys and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much